Hey guys, what's happening? So, the day has come. I gotta retire these uh, RX 5700s, or sorry, RX 570s. These are 5700s. Um, yeah, actually, I love the cards. They're just, uh, you know, I'm sucking too much power down for the amount of hash I'm getting. Um, yeah, I mean, if I didn't, if I wasn't popping breakers, I'd probably keep these cards. But I'm gonna upgrade to uh, two more RX 5700s. These are actually, in my opinion, are the best. RX 5700s, uh, best cooling and best hash rate for the power consumption. That's a Sapphire Nitro Plus. So I'm going to actually replace these four cards with two more RX 5700 XTs and just have four cards in here. But let me show you the uh, power consumption. And that's actually what really has me concerned is that, you know, with the riser, I mean, these things are probably pulling 150, 160 watts per card and doing about 15 mega hash right now. Yeah, I mean, I could still mine like Raven Coin and Beam, but yeah, it's not really the power, man. I, it's the breakers. All right, so I think I did another video about my spark plugs here, but let me show you the power consumption. So that's my sixth GPU home, and right now the power consumption is 956.2 watts. So I'm hoping to get that down by about 300 watts. Um, so I'm not gonna. I don't expect to get. I mean, it's probably it's gonna stay about the same hash rate. Because each of these two cards, kind of right now, equal a uh, RX 5700, so about 55 to 60 mega hash. So, yeah, the only thing I'm really gaining here is power consumption. Alright, so we're back in business. Minus some Ethereum. About the same hash rate as before, just two less cards and two less risers. But that's the difference right there. So, like I was right, about 300 watts. So... Yeah, hopefully I won't be popping breakers again. I also changed my NVIDIA rig over here. Yeah, you should always separate the, the models. I don't like having NVIDIA mixed with AMD. But, alright guys. Awesome. Save some power.